Hi everyone, welcome back to another house tour. Hope you all are doing well. In today's video, sharing with you all a popular model from Keep Mode Homes. This is Stratford. So stay tuned and watch this video till the end. It could be useful to you. This is located in Batley. Now going with the floor plans, in the ground floor you have the lounge, kitchen with dining and washroom. On the first floor you have two bedrooms with a common family bathroom. And on the second floor you have the master bedroom with the ensuite. Now as you enter the house you'll find a small hall in front of you with the partitions towards the first floor and also the living room. So this is the living room. The space looks quite okay. You can easily plan two sofas and a TV set and there's enough room space to walk around. Uh, there's a really big window towards the front end so plenty of natural light falling in this living room. Actually this particular model is much similar to the Stratton but it's slightly bigger than the Stratton. Simple living room and uh, the interiors done also look very bright and beautiful, especially this green sofa. I've never seen a green sofa like this. It looks very attractive. And from this living room here, uh, we'll be moving towards the kitchen and dining which are coming at the back. Also in the middle you get uh, the washroom which I'll be sharing with you all later. So this is the kitchen which is coming towards the back. And through this kitchen you also have the garden access through the French doors provided. I also like the worktop design, uh, it's spread out on all the three sides. You're getting the boiler in the kitchen. And there's a nice big window as well towards the kitchen side. So plenty of light and very good ventilation. And the fridge and freezer are coming here. Again it's up to you, if you don't want to go for the integrated fridge freezer you can plan your fridge anywhere. In Stratton, the kitchen is slightly small. You can't plan such a big dining table. But this kitchen is slightly bigger. And you also get a decent garden with fence around it. Nice kitchen and dining space. Very comfortable for small families. And uh, beside the kitchen here, you're getting the washroom. Again, uh, it's a big washroom compared to other houses. You also have a window here. So there's a water closet sink and a window. And just opposite to this washroom, you have the uh, storage space in the ground floor. Again, it's a decent space. Uh, you can plan something in this area. So we covered all the rooms here in the ground floor. Now let's move towards the first floor. On the first floor we have two bedrooms and a common family bathroom. So first exploring the first bedroom of the house. This is the first bedroom of the house. It's a double bedroom as you can see. You can plan a double cot bed and there's really good space to walk around. Uh, the space is given in length here. So if you plan a cot like this towards this side, uh, you get really good space towards the opposite side. Also you have a decent space uh, towards the front end to plan your wardrobes. I like the rooms with two windows like this. You know they look really beautiful with lots of sunlight falling in. And also the cupboards are going inside the walls so they don't disturb the space outside. Overall a decent bedroom with good space. You can plan it as a kids room, guest room, anything you want to. So just as you come out of this bedroom, towards your right side you have a small storage space. Mm -hmm. 
they gave the mains in this uh, space you can also plan some kind of storage in here and just beside it you're getting the common family bathroom a nice bathroom with a uh, really good space you're getting the bathtub water closet sink and there's a nice window And just beside this bathroom, you're having the second bedroom of the house. Uh, it's comparatively smaller than the first bedroom, which we have seen. But again, the size is quite okay. You can plan it as a kid's room or you can use it as your workspace if you want to. You still get a nice wide window. So plenty of natural light falling in this room. So this is all about the first floor. Now let's move towards the second floor and check out the master bedroom. Actually it's a three bedroom property but uh, it looks quite big. I also like this landing space here, you're getting a window. So you get some natural sunlight falling on the staircase as well. Now in these type of models where you have three stores, uh, the topmost bedroom will be the master bedroom and uh, they try to maximize the space. It's a beautiful bedroom with really good space as you can see. Uh, towards the front side you get a nice window so plenty of light falling in this bedroom. So this uh, entire area they used for the bed space and uh, without disturbing the other corner they actually planned the wardrobes. It's good if you have the wardrobe space given separately that won't disturb the room space. But again it's up to you if you want a bigger wardrobe then you can plan one inside as well. And uh, here comes the ensuite. Again it's a decent bathroom. You have the shower cubicle water closet sink and uh, there's a window on the top so really good natural light falling in the bathroom and there's a small door here and uh, inside this you have a really big storage space which is the speciality of these kind of uh, houses from keep mode you can plan um, a lot of storage in here we covered all the rooms in this property I really like this model, it's quite comfortable, even though it's a 3 bed house, it was looking very big. Uh, even the first floor, ground floor and also the bedroom, the master bedroom, all of them are really good. They have their own space. I hope you liked watching my today's video. Do give me your suggestions and feedback in the comment section, I would love to hear from you. Also if you are watching my channel for the first time and if you haven't subscribed yet, make sure to hit the subscribe button and feel free to activate the bell icon at the bottom so that you won't miss out on my future uploads. Stay safe, stay connected, see you in another vlog.